Jackson Taylor had finally made it, his paranormal romance novel was being published by the prestigious Star Publishing. As a newly minted author, he was thrilled but nervous to be working closely with his editor, the brilliant and beautiful Megan Carter. Unbeknownst to Megan, she was the inspiration behind Jackson's latest work, a sultry fan fiction in which she starred as the irresistible object of his deepest desires. In the dimly lit offices of Star Publishing, the chemistry between Jackson and Megan was palpable from their first meeting. Megan's striking green eyes and wavy raven tresses captivated Jackson, her hourglass figure accentuated by a pencil skirt that hugged her curves. He struggled to stay focused, his mind suddenly filled with the simple scenarios he had penned, imagining her lithe body pressed against his as their lips met in a passionate embrace. Sure, no one would ever read his intimate fantasies, Jackson had been reckless in his explicit descriptions, holding nothing back as he documented his cravings for Megan in lurid detail. But in a disastrous turn of events, he accidentally sent the wrong manuscript, the torrid fanfiction rather than his tame paranormal novel. Jackson's world imploded as Megan meticulously edited the file, line by salacious line. At first, Megan is oblivious that she is the subject of Jackson's forbidden longings. But as the revisions continue in close quarters, the heated tension becomes undeniable. Jackson lives in a perpetual state of mortification, his face flushing crimson whenever Megan's eyes meet his with a quizzical look after encountering one of the raunchier passages. Try as he might to keep his cool professionalism, Jackson's resolve was crumbling. Megan was too intoxicating to resist, seemingly unaware of how enticing she was with her tight pencil skirts and low-cut blouses. The slightest brush of her hand would set Jackson's skin ablaze with desire. He found himself crafting feeble lies to explain away the graphic fantasies, praying she remained blind to the truth. But Megan was too brilliant to be deceived forever. Slowly, the awful realization crystallized, this manuscript was not paranormal fiction but rather a thinly veiled erotic chronicle of Jackson's unrestrained lust for her. As the shocking truth was unveiled, Jackson braced for the consequences, fearing that he had sabotaged his career and any chance at exploring the real sparks between them. With her pride stung but her curiosity piqued, Megan finally confronted Jackson, demanding to know if he truly viewed her as the smoldering vixen described so vividly. In that heated moment, Jackson's fictional fantasies and reality finally blurred. Bearing his deepest vulnerabilities, he confessed his unrestrained passion for his editor, the woman who had haunted his every waking thought and dream. To Jackson's delirious delight and disbelief, Megan responded by pulling him into a searing kiss, silencing his worries as her hands roamed hungrily over his body. Finally, after agonizing weeks of self-imposed longing, their insatiable desires could be sated as Megan breathlessly whispered that she wanted to make his most lurid fantasies a reality.